Good morning everyone. I am J. Suresh Kumar, working as an assistant professor, Department of English, KSR College of Arts and Science for Women. Today, we are going to see the topic of literary criticism for the paper of E.A. English, third year final year. Let's enter into the topic. The topic covers in today's video are Unit 1, Unit 2 and Unit 3. The Unit 1 consists of concepts and schools. It consists of literary criticism, the types of criticism and what are the different types of criticism and schools, the different schools in criticism. The second unit it covers a Greek and a Roman criticism, especially in Greek and Roman literature and their cultures. The Greek master, you are well known about the Aristotle, who was a famous a Greek master in Aristotle. And second, the Roman classicist Horace, William Horace, well known about the Horace. And the third unit is British criticism. It especially deals about the British literature and its criticism. The main important works are the Battle of Taste, written by the Philip Sidney, and the Trump of the Classicism was written by Dr. Johnson. What is literary criticism? The way of reading that enhances your understanding of the text by focusing on particular elements or perspective. The way of opening by the text to meaning that might otherwise never have occurred to you. The elements of the literature. Literature has both a text and human element. The human element contains uh, both author and reader. These elements are the basis of the rhetorical triangle. The rhetorical triangle means there are three types of angles. One is a reader, one is a writer and one is a reviewer. Each approach has its advantage and limitations. What are the main theories in the literature? A formalist, a biographical, psychological, historical, sociological, political, it covers under the sociological and next to Marx theory, a feminist, a mythological, a reader response theory and deconstructionist. Formalist criticism, focus on the action form of the text, its language, structure and tone. It pays attention to the intrinsic elements of the work, metaphor, simple, characters, a plot and narrative techniques. A biographical criticism, it generally we know well known about the biographical word itself. A biographical means something about a writer and his their personal histories, background of the work. It explores the author life to understand the text more fully. A psychological criticism, it means a personal inner feeling. A psychological means draw upon the psychoanalytical theories, a Sigmund Freud theories, have a fuller understanding of the text of writer and the reader. Historical criticism, history of means understanding the history which more clearly. A sociological criticism is also called a political criticism. It examines the social groups and relationships and values of the appear in the text. Marxist criticism is focused on the ideological core, effect on the culture, ecological, race and culture of the power. Feminist criticism, it deals about the feminine and its their works. Reader response criticism, it deals about the reader and their impacts in the work. Deconstitutionism, its criticism was coined with the Derrida. Remember the literary theory is seen confusing or 